All right, good morning everybody or good afternoon like I always say in my videos I don't know when you're watching this, but it is Saturday morning Beautiful beautiful sunny San Diego Saturday morning check out that skyline right behind me nice and sunny sunny San Diego Well, I'm out here at Harbor Island once again the tide has dropped So I am fishing the incoming tide and I do literally only have about two hours to fish Then I got to go run some errands and maybe if I can make it back out. I'll make it back out, but yeah, I just felt like getting out to fish, you know, after a week of hard work, you know, putting in my time to support the family, feed the kids and whatnot, I finally managed to make, a, you know, make some time, a couple hours to come out here to do some good old fishing and hopefully get some dope content for you guys. Um, there's really not much to say. I'm just going to be optimistic, get out here and get my lines wet. So you guys stick with me and hopefully I stick a monster. So stay tuned, guys. Let's go. See what time it is it is 805 i got until 9 45 to fish almost two hours it takes about 20 minutes 15 minutes to get home so let's see what i should start off with you know what let's see this is still good i'm gonna start off with a moving bait or aka the jerk bait a couple casts here and there and hope we stick something if not then move on to a slow slow little swim bay at the bottom it is low tide we did have a grinding run last night but i don't know if they came in or not but usually when it's the full moon the fishing is on and off when it's on it's on morning Water's too glassy not to give top water a try. Oh yeah, I got bait busting to my left. I haven't had a top water bite in a while. Would be nice to get one. Let me try to get leveled with the water. Extremely slippery from last night. Oh shit! <laughs> All right. I completely just ate shit right now. That shit hurt. Oh, that hurt so bad. I am going to feel that in the morning. I gashed up my skin, my knee, pretty banged up. All right, top water wasn't cutting it. They're busting, but they weren't coming up to it. Hold on, dude. Chilling. I recognize you. <laughs> What's up, so, <laughs> Catch anything? Well, I was throwing a top water, but they weren't coming in for it. Yeah. But ate shit. No. I fell. Oh, yeah, <laughs> too. It was super slippery. <laughs> you guys catch anything? Yeah, we got a couple spotties out in there. Where? Little... Oh, down that way? Yeah, down that other, right next to the. But I just got out here. Woke up a little late. We we're out till like two last night. We were fishing for leopards and rays. You guys about to leave? I was about to go check out Coronado or something. Uh, right now, I would. It's pretty low everywhere. Yeah. I would go right over here, Spanish Landing. Oh yeah. But I'll try it over here. I'm I'm probably gonna bounce over there. It's only a dollar an hour. Oh nice. So it's not that expensive. Yeah yeah. I mean you could pay by the 15 minutes. You could pay like 75 cents for 45 minutes. Yeah. But they only take card and quarters. Crazy, I recognize that. I recognize that somewhere. <laughs> we were just watching that video like two days ago. Nice. Right on, brother. All right, man. Take care. Good luck, dude. Let's get him. 
Oh, I'm gonna head over to Spanish Landing. Damn it, accidentally paid for a full four. <laughs> paid for a full four hours. <laughs> oh well, I'll give it to someone if I didn't want to park. That water is dirty over here up close. Apart from all the boats. There we go. Yeah, buddy. Ooh, he's angry. Check that out. Little guy. There you go. Oh, he feel sick in the water. <laughs> there you go, second bass in the morning, 18 grams. I was checking my camera, he picked it up on the drop. It's a halibut. It's a halibut. <laughs> It's a good one. <sighs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> Damn. These. It looks right on the line, dude. Hey, 22 on the dot. <laughs> oh, you got no? You got one too? Yeah. There you go. Oh, right, I gotta back this guy up real quick and get back back out there, dude. I got about 30 more minutes to fish. All right, here you go. First legal halibut of the year. <laughs> you guys are wondering what I got it on? 18 gram Jigparo spin. Check that out right there. Six pound test on the Abu Garcia Aor Elite. 10 pound mainline, six pound fluorocarbon, 18 gram Jigparo spin. Right there guys. <laughs> Super dope right there. Beautiful fish, then take him home to mama. I'm gonna eat him. There we go. <laughs> All right. Bam. Teeth though. 
check out the teeth got them real good right there you guys don't know lee goes 22 on the dot here we go <laughs> well i'm gonna bag them up and possibly get back to fishing we'll see how it goes Twenty-two on a dot. My mom just told me uh, two days ago I want halibut too. Dude, that's my first league of the year. That jig par is killing it, huh? Dang, you got halibut, spotty. What's next? The shark? There you go. Little guy. Hey, like a train though. And sometimes if they're, if they're not keyed in on this big bait, downsize, and they'll, they'll destroy it. Some of my biggest fish was ever caught on like one inch baits. They'll just engulf it. Uh, seven gram, which is a quarter ounce. But they, uh, they're gonna release a 15 or 14 gram, right, a half ounce? Cause what size are you throwing? Yeah, that's, that's a little over half. But 18 is perfect for the bay. Oh, dang, he hit it like a train. <laughs> He's not even fighting no more. He's like, whatever, dude. You probably caught me before. He ate that back trouble. Oh, biggest bass all morning. Biggest one today, this is probably about like 10. Chill, homie. I'm trying to make you famous. You guys didn't see that, right? <laughs> no, this guy's pissed. There you go. I am super stoked guys. I'm calling it a day right there. I have obligations I gotta attend to. And um, I'm I'm happy that I made it out this morning. You know, I was out last night till about 11 o'clock with my buddy Mike Knott and John. Uh, we were doing some ray fishing last night and uh, we managed a couple. But today, this morning, an hour and a half, two hour session was definitely worth it. Like I told you guys, if you guys can make it out here, get you know get up don't be lazy be optimistic get up and get out here you never know what you're gonna get you know learn to adapt learn to figure it out and eventually eventually you'll get one and uh, also for everything that I use check the description below rod reel lure underwear everything uh, be sure to check that out all right so yeah it was definitely fun it was nice running into some subscribers out there Raul um, I'm sorry other guy <laughs> Completely forgot your name. I'm gonna butcher it right there. Uh, it was good fishing with you. Thanks a lot for helping me measure out that legal halibut. You know, I was very, very, very skeptical on the size. I was, I was saying 21, 22. So I go to my trunk, dumped out a bag, and there you go. The, it, it was, it was destiny. Put it that way. My measurement tool came out. I was like, hell yeah, let's measure this guy. It has to be illegal. Busted it out. Pulled it right by the halibut and. A little over 22. Super duper stoked. My first legal of the year. 
cannot beat that it cannot you know it cannot be any morning just like that it would have been nice if it was a giant but illegal is illegal a halibut is a halibut and it was on the jikpara spin illegal halibut on the jikpara spin my mom has been asking me for halibut and i told her i'll try to get her illegal and she just barely asked me literally two days ago and i finally got her illegal halibut and i'm bringing it to her right now so I'm gonna end the video right there guys. So if you guys are new to this channel, consider subscribing. I'm trying my best to put out content for you guys and do as much as I can to, you know, do some fishing and stuff. Work has been picking up. You know, my kids are in school. I gotta bounce around, you know, like my schedule is hectic. So every weekend comes by, I try to at least pump out, you know, an hour to two to three hours a morning, Saturday or Sunday morning to do some fishing for you guys. And lately it has been a success for me to be able to do that for you guys, so yeah. So give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. If you didn't enjoy it, give me a thumbs down. I don't care. But I'm going to end it right there. I probably said that earlier. But yeah, I'm going to end it right there. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. As always, good fishing and peace out.